Kai is known for his unique posing routines. Over the years, he continued to impress fans all over the world with his skills on the stage. This time, he wants to take it a step further. He doesn't want to repeat anything he's done before. He examines his previous work and thinks of his next steps. This is the beginning of his return to the stage. There's a lot of skills that I still need to work on getting command of in order to be able to have the impact that I would like to have. And I think it's one of those things that you can get better at as you continue to work. You're, you're moving into a section where all of a sudden you're hitting a pose and it's like a moment. And then you kind of dance or use a movement to get into the next thing, which I thought was super interesting. Even as a person that's not taking school on your, you know, deltoids. <laughs> So, While rehearsing, thoughts of his past flow over him, including the time he spent in an institution for troubled youth, the place where Kai discovered bodybuilding. I went in an institutional placement as a kid that had an interest in literature, poetry, singing, dancing. I can connect and express myself that way very easily. But now, I'm in a very hostile environment, so I didn't sing, I didn't think about dancing and walk around with no poetry book. I concentrated on getting strong. You always have a moment where you're doing something acrobatic. Well, we, That's on in, purpose. in the past we've tried, yeah, yeah. we've tried to be, because... It's like a climax. Well, yeah, you need, I, I thought there needs to be, in a routine, particularly if you have three minutes, there needs to be three specific things that you do yeah. that Ben, yeah. you did this one. Oh, this is, you just took it to this level, okay? Uh -huh. This was, oh, wow. That's something somebody's going to talk about. Right. After. Then you do the next thing. And yeah. then you do the last thing. And that last thing, you know, was a little bit above the first two. Mm -hmm. And that's your zenith point. Wow. In the institutional placement, in that little world, I went from being the dude that couldn't go to the bathroom by himself to something else. And at the end of that experience, once I got discharged, you can be in a normal society. But in reality, you know, you had no high school credits, you had no real command of the skills that you need to have in this social setting, this normal social setting, you know. Welcome to a new world of challenges with experiences like that on the table. How will they see you now going forward? Generation Iron Podcast with Kai Green every Wednesday.